What's up with it, y'all? It's Big Boss, and I'm coming back with another before you buy of like this baby out. right here. Ain't nobody listening to him. Bitch, I pop a perk, then I sleep. I've been having drinks since a kid. Everything he said, I didn't be. Jooby, jooby, joop, 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 joop. Jooby, dooby, joop, joop, joop. All right, y'all, this is the bottle right here. It is Jupe Home, okay? This is the batch code on the bottom. Put it on the screen so y'all can see it. All right, check it out, check it out. All right, pie y'all. Jupe is a fragrance, old school fragrance. I'm talking about bumping grind. All right, back in the day, 1989. Yo mama, yo daddy, they was rocking this, okay? Why I say your mom and your dad? Why? Because it's a unisex fragrance, okay? This fragrance is a warm, spicy, vanilla, floral fragrance. Okay, straight up. Now look, this is an unpopular opinion. I feel like this fragrance is great for the summertime. It's just a certain vibe, okay? I know when y'all hear these notes, I'm finna say you might think that it's great for like maybe like fall and winter time, but I think this is one of them fragrances you kind of wanted it to be a little... Uh, sweet and punchy like only a few people can really pull something like this off now i'm not saying you got to be like floor, uh, uh flamboyant or anything like that but it takes a certain man that's more on the sexy side that can pull something like this off you know what i'm saying i don't think this is for like the super masculine 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 man that'll rock something like time for an unbreak leather this is more for the softer cooler uh you know hey girl man sorry so sorry let's okay let's talk about the scent straight out the gate when you spray it on it's gonna smell real like cough medicine okay straight out the gate but then it kind of like dry down and smell a little bubble gum cinnamony you know what i mean but if i can really describe how this smells to a t it smells like the red hot gum all right, that spicy gum. That is what this smell like when you chew it. You did, yeah, red hot. Okay, old school red hot cinnamon. Okay, so the notes in this fragrance can be a little misleading. All right, so I wouldn't blind by this. I wouldn't read the notes and be like, I'm gonna go pick this up. Top notes has orange, blossom, mandarin, bergamot, lemon. The middle notes got jasmine, cinnamon, cardamom base notes got vanilla patchouli honey tonka bean and a little hint of tobacco but i don't smell none of that i've been smelling this all morning trying to really figure out this smell it just smells like cough syrup like bubble gum cinnamon cough syrup you know what i'm saying like that is what this smells like am i a fan of this no Okay, now I looked online, they said this lasts a long time. This lasts the longest, the longest, the longest. It, it's just the longevity, bro. I don't know if it's the batch I got, but I can't get more than like five hours on the skin with this. And when, when they always champion how long it lasts, I'm thinking that my hair is gonna last on my skin about like at least eight hours. It's gonna last a long time, but I don't know how much it lasts on clothes because I'm not a fan of spraying it on the clothes because I wouldn't want my clothes to smell like this. You know what I mean? And if it do last long, I wouldn't want my clothes to just be destroyed by this scent, okay? So, no, okay? On the skin, does not last that long. And when it comes to projection, I'm about to tell y'all, I'm about to do a live test right now. I'm about to spray. I'm about to see how far away until I stop smelling it, man. You're going to spray it right here. Okay, spray it on the hand. We're going to be right here. So I smell it heavy, like this far. I smell it real heavy, like. This far, I still smell it. Oh, I still smell it. And we this far. Can't really smell it, but we're able to rhyme because you know you'll be walking. So, what is that, like a foot and a half? I'll give it like a foot and a half of projection, squared. So, you're going to take a little good cloud wearing this, okay? Now, let's talk about the bottle design, okay? The Anamizer is actually really high quality, okay? Like, it, like the Anamizer kind of reminds me of the Dior Sauvage Anamizer, like this. 
like for it to be, you know what I'm saying, least expensive, cheap, the atomizer is, is great, okay? Mwah. You can pick this up in a lot of different stores like Walmart online, a lot of places. You can go on fragrancenet.com, the discounters. You can find this in a lot of variety of places for no more than like $18, $20. You might find it for like $13. You shouldn't pay more than, I'd say 25 for a bottle. You know what I mean? That's how you know you're paying too much, okay? You, can, you might even find a bottle somewhere on eBay or something for $10, you know what I'm saying? So you really don't wanna pay that much. You wanna look around, shop around, try to not pay too much for this because this is a real cheap fragrance, okay? Closing notes, closing thoughts, I kinda say, um, it's cool, it's okay. It smells like a fragrance that's um, out right now. So for this fragrance to be released in 1989, it was groundbreaking, I can imagine, because it smells so similar to what cologne smell like right now. Okay, like Invictus kind of remind me of this a tad bit. You know what I mean? Like Paco Rebound One Million, even though I think One Million smells better, it's just got that same type of feel. Okay, so I do think this was ahead of its time. I do think you could still pull it off 2022 and up. You know what I mean? Because the DNA still hits hard, still hits home. I can see a lot of expensive fragrances. Like, like this can pass for something like really expensive. Okay. So out of 10, I'll get this fragrance, maybe like a 7.5 out of 10. Okay. Now, if you like this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. It's Big Boss. And I'm out. Bitch, I'm big boss, I'm a threat Bitch, nigga, pipe down, for I flex I'ma put a whole lot of money on your dreads Like a bowling ball, I put a hole in your head Shit that you rap in your songs, I'll be lying